All right, here's another short video I wanted to do. Um, since I've been doing keeping fish, I've always had the hang on back filters. Haven't done the sponge filters, but I uh, I picked up this 55 gallon tank. Um, and so I've been collecting these for about a year or so. And for, with this one, I decided to go with the canister filter. Uh, I chose Fluval. It was at a local store next to me. I could buy all the parts. Everything was easy to get. And, you know, I was kind of nervous to, is it too much? Do you get the canister filter? Um, can you s stick with the sponge filter? Um, and so I, I went for it. The 307 is what I picked out. Um, it seemed to be a little bit more filtration that was probably needed for the tank, but I wanted to do it anyway. And just a quick review on this one. This thing, ridiculously quiet, sits in the cabinet. Um, tubes are set up, runs up underneath. You have an intake. I For extra filtration, I added my own um, sort of pre-filter sponge. I cut it open uh, and added this uh, on there, which has been amazing. Uh, it catches tons of loose leaves and um, extra odds and ends has been floating around there. And especially, I do have quite a bit of shrimp, and so they like to hang out on this thing and uh, munch on certain stuff. Here in the back, you have one, two, it runs to the uh, intake for the canister, and then the other one runs all the way to the other side. But I just did a video with this one. Uh, I had the original um, outflow tube for it that was basically here. It shot out a ton of water. It's kind of like a jet ski type thing. So I put this on there, but I, I love it. The Fluval 307, I think is awesome. Um, I pretty much go with all their stuff. I have their light it sets on a timer. Uh, you never have to worry about anything. It just kind of goes, um, you can set uh, settings for it to increase, decrease, depending on how much light or and how long you need it. But yeah, this thing with the 307, the tank's been great. Fish are doing awesome. Um, everything's pretty much crystal clear. You can kind of see a little bit, a little bit of algae, you know, stuff right there. Uh, I haven't cleaned it recently, but um, otherwise, you know, that would be pretty clean there. But yeah, everything's doing great. There's tons of shrimp, a bunch of little fish. I had I had a lot more plants. Um, got rid of a couple just to kind of downsize a little bit. But yeah, with the uh, 307 in the canister filter, I think it's a game changer um, in keeping plants and fish. And it's made a huge difference um, in making sure everything stays clean, fish stay healthy, um, and then you can keep plants growing and, um, you know, kind of add and change things as you like.